finish. Yeah. We can now, now go and have a beer. As soon as the time has gone, it will just stop and hold it, serve it 10 minutes later, 5 minutes okay, later. Great. Let me just explain a little bit more, yeah. if I may. So what are you um, doing here? Well, in, in here, really, I mean, this is a wonderful slow cooker. We've got a chicken cacciatore. Um, we've got rice, you know, steaming above it. So you've got two layers, eh? so... Uh, Absolutely, yeah. yeah. And, you can yeah. Put, and you've got another layer in there as well. You can put fish, you add a third and chicken, yeah. Yeah, so you yeah. can do stuff. We've got just traditional Florentina style potatoes. So George, get your camera in there, big boy. Rosemary, garlic, uh, cute potatoes. Um, over here, we've got a classic oh, wow. uh, chili con yeah. carne. Um, again, this, this is, is a sort going of... This is to be my favorite. This yeah. is a two hour. Yeah. So we go, we go through the equivalent of this process. Yeah. Get your tomatoes in, your beans, turn it on, leave it, no stirring, nothing like that. Want to add some coriander? No. Okay. <laughs> no, no. Like, actually, go on. Just go on, go on a little bit. Um, and then over here we've got some desserts. So because the temperature goes very low in this as well, um, we can be melting chocolate. Yeah. You know, we could be making lovely on glazes. Um, also, I've made a, a rice pudding here, uh, which is stewed oh, away beautifully. Great. I've done previously some yeah. stewed fruits. So that is the home cooker. And everyone, you'll see with all the backup and the advertising that we're doing, yeah. we've worked with different families from different backgrounds, and we've given them one of these bits of equipment. And also, the other thing is I've written exclusive yeah. recipes for the, when you get so one of these. This is in the packaging, so you get this free with the home cooker. Yeah, just basically yeah. to, you know, people, in the end, people will make this their own. Yeah. They like to cook their own things in a certain yeah. way, but um, we want to give them inspiration to get them started. Yeah. yeah. So tell us uh, also a little bit about some other products that you developed with us, because this is the home cooker, this yes. is the star product, but there is more. A absolutely. I mean, I think um, what we were trying to... What I was really chuffed to do with Philips, um, I've worked with some people over the years, I'm very fussy about who I work with, um, I was a little bit disappointed to find out that Philips was Dutch and not British. Um, uh, I always thought that well, way. Well, personal. I, know, no, no. I always thought that was based on when, when I come from near Cambridge, so I used to drive into Cambridge and there'd be Philips there, and I'd be like, yeah, Royal Britannia. Philips is um, everywhere. <laughs> God bless you. Um, but um, no. Um, it, from my point of view, I'm a chef, but also I love the process of pictures and being creative. And what's interesting is this is about in innovation. Yeah. And in the pipeline, a lot of what we're doing is about innovation. But what I try to do with my tools, which is blenders, liquidizers, the processors, is to be honest, I'm, I'm sort of almost anti-innovation. Like the whole world and industry is trying to, they're all spending money on doing all these little extra bits. Yeah. And what I wanted to do with Philips was clean it up, clean up the design, make it beautiful. So make good it basic tool. Simple. Yeah. Simple, simple. I don't want extra bits and pieces and tasks. I just want it to work and turn on and turn off and, and have big engines, sharp blades. So for me, the process, I work with your guys very closely and I was able to really affect simplicity of design. And hopefully if you guys see it out there, you'll agree yeah. it's, it's nice. It's all on the stand, so uh, we'll talk about it later. Yeah, yeah, yeah absolutely. It was, a, it was a really, really good process. Now, the lovely Georgie has yeah. come into the fold. <laughs> so this basically means that we're able to plate up some nice food. Um, I'm going to start plating up, if you don't mind, Pete. Yeah, of course. Um, ahead, so. Have any of you eaten this morning? Anyone lunch? hungry? Anyone yeah. feel like a little girl? Like we have about five hundred plates here. Yeah. So we can, uh, yeah. Yeah. Anyone like coriander? <laughs> <laughs> okay, Peter, if you yeah. wouldn't mind holding that, my friend. Okay. So, um, yeah, we've had we've had some real fun um, with this, and I think you know the one thing that I know working in the public eye and with the public um, yeah. is that. You know, the household has changed over the last 30 years. You know, mums and dads are both working very, very hard. Time is incredibly important, as we all know, and convenience. But you know what? At the same time, the general public has become more advanced. They, yeah. they know more dishes. They expect more. They experience so, more. Yeah. Definitely. I mean, making a paella and a risotto in this was like it was born for it. Yeah. The risotto is all about massaging the starch out of the beautiful rice grains and making it creamy and oozy. Incredible. Yeah. I mean, yeah. do you really want to stir it for 20 minutes? <laughs> really? You got this is doing it for you. Unbelievable. Yeah. So let's go with the chili. Let's have a little go here. So. We've got a ladle. Yeah. Here we go. We'll then I'm wearing a, an apron. And by the way, this yeah. comes off straight away, straight, okay. in, straight into the dishwasher. Over here, Peter, just yeah. come down a little bit. Yeah. So we'll go in with a classic chili con carne there. I'm going to wow. serve up the curry really? now. Uh, Georgie, if you'd be so kind, uh, you can be my extra pair of hands. 
very glamorous pair of hands. Um, if you can plate up that lovely vanilla rice pudding for me, um, that would be wonderful. Um, the other thing is, is you know, it doesn't stop you doing your usual cooking. You can have a roast chicken in the oven, yeah, yeah. and you could be doing incredible vegetables in here. You know, you could be doing beautiful slow cooked, you know, it's uh, zucchini, sweet onions. You know, here we've got Florentina potatoes. So it's nice just having them chugging away, working. So I'll just move that out of the way. We're a little bit short in space here. So there's yeah. the first one. I'll pour this out. We've got a lovely vanilla rice pudding here, which is an absolute classic. Back home. Wow. Yeah. So pour that away. Tiny stick of cinnamon in there was really good as well. And then earlier, this machine's wonderful. I said for melting chocolate, but also uh, for doing jams. Wonderful for jams and preserving like that. Yeah. And I've got some stewed fruits here which I'm just going to pour over. Oh, that looks lovely. Absolutely gorgeous. And let's do the curry. Let's do the curry. Last but not least. Come, come around here, Pete. Yeah. Sorry to, sorry to uh, And I'll sprinkle you yeah. with some coriander. Um, sorry, Georgie. So, uh, <laughs> just, just round here, Pete. Do you yeah. want to just take that one down? Okay. So there's our, oh, there we go. our chili. And then we'll go for our southern Indian curry. Um, again, we've got some rice here. And another platter. Yeah. Last but not least. The lovely thing about this cup, I, I guess what I've been trying to express in this little demonstration is you can do your veggies, yeah. full whack, you know, 40 minutes, getting crispy, crispy. Your stews, your cacciatories, your chilies, your bolognese, you know, one hour, two hour, no problem. Your risottos, 20 minutes on the head. Paella, 18 minutes, you know, once you get the rice in. You know, uh, the curry here is 10 minutes. So from fast cooking to slow cooking, it, I think it represents. Yeah. In a so nice is, it, is it ready now? Yeah, it's, yeah. it's ready to go. Yeah. Yeah. Do you like curries? Oh yeah. This is really nine and a half minutes now, eh? so not more than that. So I think we did a no, great so, job. As soon, yeah. as, you, as soon as you get, you don't really want to boil the hell out of co um, coconut milk to keep it fragrant and delicious. You know, just bring it to the boil. Um, but the wonderful thing about this area of India, uh, it's very tropical. So ginger, chilies. Yeah. Um, it's not a heavy curry. It's a very healthy, light curry. And, and George, if you just come in here, my darling, just have a little look at that. I'll take this out. Just have a look in there. Um, wonderful curry, uh, wonderful colour. What I, I need to do is just have a little taste, have a little correction of seasoning if it need if need be. You know, if you want to hit I it, I think up, I did a really good job. So you, it doesn't need a lot of correction. No, you are quite no. perfect, Peter. <laughs> but I'm sure all your staff tell you that as well. Um, <laughs> I, I used to work for Peter, um, and then in goes the curry. Wow. Please, yeah. please, try, try this curry. It's, it's one of the most fabulous dishes that celebrates that region wow. of yeah. India. I, I'm sure you guys can smell it. Um, oh, it's it's really light, it's yeah. fragrant. I think it kind of shows you... The I'll put it here. Yeah. More coriander. I think yeah. a couple of people, who would like to try some? So here from the first row, just... Uh, Good man, we've got yeah. the man with the camera. Let's give him a little um, yeah. poor show now. And then I've, I've done my big pee. Well, I think uh, this is the proof. So here you go. Hello, sir. What's your name? Ali. Ali, so. going to from Turkey. Okay, so okay, I'll, I'll take here. <laughs> yeah. Are you still running? Enjoy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is a big moment in your life. <laughs> Ali from Turkey is eating curry from India. <laughs> What do you think? It's great. Beautiful. Thank no. God for that. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Just enjoy the rest of it. Thank you for having me. So, James, it's been great to have you here. So, thank you very, very much. And it really has been a pleasure to develop these great tools together with you. So, my team really enjoyed it. So we'll continue with this. So, uh, great to have you here. And you give a warm hand to uh, Jamie Oliver, ladies and gentlemen. take off my apron and continue with some other great innovations. So uh, we have more to show you than of course uh, the home cooker. So um, please visit our stand. You will, fit, you will find the home cooker. You find a lot of other great tools that we have uh, jointly developed with, uh, with Jamie. Uh, but also more great innovations like the Philips style shaver, helping men express their personality and achieve more looks with fewer tools or the Sonicare power-up from our family 
of power toothbrushes, and this product really brings healthy smiles to even more people. The new wake-up light, it's inspired, the design is inspired by the sun, and really featuring the latest LED technology. The Saeco Expralia Evo for the best latte macchiato ever. And last but not least, the Senseo Twist, the latest design in Senseo. Just to name a few, we have much more to offer on our stand. So now let's talk about sound and connected entertainment. Philips is the European market leader in docking speakers and in audio systems. And we built that leadership on three pillars, on sound, on design, and on innovation. We are obsessed with sound, and we want you to experience music just as the artist intended it. And we have a team of more than 50 designers worldwide, and some of the best technical minds in the business to make this come true. So this year, we launched the Philips Fidelio brand. And Fidelio stands for performance and style. Natural sounds, distinctive design, and ease of use. Every product is assessed by a panel of trained listeners, and we call them our golden ears. And no product goes into production without having two-thirds of these golden ears judging it better than its competition. So let's look at some of these products. So this is the A9 Fidelio Wireless Hi-Fi. It's the ultimate solution for high-definition wireless at home. So works with your phone, either Apple or Android, or with your tablet or PC. And you really, all you need is these great speakers and your PC.